and we're back with more not for broadcast uh last episode was pretty hectic but uh let's see how this one goes uh let's get my tapes in crazy now and we kind of moved away but the annual magnificent pre-christmas extravaganza that's like a second place must be played an essential message from the government and does that mean? Anybody want to go on a cruise? The cruise of a lifetime? Uh, bring your friends or make new ones? Anybody want to go on a cruise? Oh, I gotta. They do know this is the news, don't they? The Illuminati like me enough. Let's let's appease somebody else. You in 40 seconds till we're live. Okay. I got a new setup here. Look at my new audio mixer. I can't really play with the little dials. No, I can't. But um, looks like I got the happy, the laugh track, the ooh track, and the the boo track. So we we, we got it all. We got it all. That's it, right? No, no crazy looking around. No, no Five Nights at Freddy's. Just news. Fake news. Good evening. This is the National Nightly News. I'm Megan Wolf. It's the 100th. All right, we got an A B segment. Our main headline. Let me get you hyped for the company of heroes. Skirmishes on land and sea again today as our armed forces test the people of the World Council's illegal blockade. Advanced strategy All right, we got Company of Heroes or Fallen Valor. Uh, let's hype them up. Because I know they're going to try to take all my points later. The next strike. We got to pad these stats. Proud parents throughout the territory find themselves Stat padding. We camping right now. Commitment of their incredible children and the job they're doing keeping supply lines open against all possible odds. Don't starve. Advances food program moved from strength to strength today as rationing depots were Anybody opened in the last stars? remaining unfed areas of the play territory. That. That's a the rationing off. depots have been constructed. Um, okay, in one time. slice of bread in serious depression or propaganda in food. What do you think? And judging by the looks yeah. on this happy family's faces, we padded. It. We got a pad. Too soon. They'll be I wish that was there. Tonight on the government, just like the rest of us. Seven days to die. The recent decision to allow those with long-term health conditions Aren't to these access transition centers has today been declared an overwhelming success. Did they produce Previously those too? Only to those in their final um, okay, years. we got the super bright, happy guy or super dull, like sad waiting room lobby. For it to be opened up to Tell the me, community. what you think? The transition centers have reported larger than expected numbers, but report right, that they are next? coping well what's and next? able to provide a complete and Everybody doing something different there. All who choose to use it. Still on the same page. Populous. More than 11% of the population have thus far failed to register right, for a Super dark ID card. check or a uh, happy conversation. A legal requirement from midnight tonight. It's up to the other 89% of us Clap. to remind our Ooh, tiny friends that lab track. the advantage of not all yet. the exclusive services available to cardholders is now, as it should be, absolutely criminal. Start me up. Disrupt Beam spokesman up, Alan James held an impromptu rally today in the northern city of Manchester. Why is Alan James not? Large crowds gathered to hear the band speaker not in, prove not disrupt in custody. are still able to capture the public's imagination. The dude gave his name the out like, like, like I am the resistance or a part of it or like, come on. Is that legal? Disrupt events, but thankfully managed to keep I guess technically speaking he didn't play the tape. He was just and on the tape. Tonight. You know, if the tape fits, nah, I'm, I'm kidding. Our mutual friend. Bail was denied in the High Court today for shamed former National Nightly News anchor Jeremy Jeremy, Donaldson. Jeremy Donaldson. The presenter will be transferred to new lodgings I'm at go with three. Prison, Even though the, the gun is in there. Should be okay. Should be okay. Still 18 months away begin. Following his very public breakdown on this program, we couldn't crop that out no more. The once loved presenter was disarmed and taken into custody by the community cohesion team. Let's hope doctors can help the once great man. But first this evening, with the war about to enter its why 21st is this, why is hot? and people why is no up and down hot the country, when I'm queuing in the three that's dead. They're trying to throw me off right now. No. That's coming up on tonight's National Nightly News. Got it. All right. What you got? What you got? Is it? Is it? be killing it with the music though. Oh. That was 
like a tenth of a second. Get real. All right, we back. Boom. In part two, I'm a little overexcited to announce. Right I'll be here. interviewing the one and only Lil C. And later, we've got oh, a new feature that's, that's sure great. to keep you coming back for more. But first tonight, let's check in with Prime Minister Peter Clement, who's speaking to us from his home in Lanfordshire. Good evening, it's Prime Minister. Hot. Have we, we caught go. you exercising? Oh, have we started? You got a pillow yes, on. that's right, Miss Wolf. Uh, just a few minor adjustments. I mean, nothing <laughs> drastic. I haven't joined the gym or anything. As my old man used to say, just because she won't take it up the shit, it doesn't mean you shouldn't try for a quick right. fiddle up the car. Language, park. Prime Minister. For real. Language, Prime Minister. What? Make my job easy. Help me out. What, what's wrong? Oh, shit. Mm -hmm. uh, yes. Shit, isn't it? Yep. Yep. That's the one. And can you tell us what brought about this new you? Well, you know, Mrs. C and I were watching, you know, the night the blockade right. began. I guess when I'm going to have to use my ears a little bit. Well, you know. Mario 64 know, as I'm sure style. You all remember. And I, I were a bit wheezy from all the cigars and yeah. all that. And mm -hmm. Mrs. C turns to me after, you know, after mm -hmm. the signal mm -hmm. dropped away. Yeah. And she was in floods of tears. And she says, peace She mm -hmm. says, I could go on without you. She says, so I made a decision. Right. And since that day, I have stopped smoking cigars. Except for Christmas. My birthday. And holiday. Weddings. Basically any time. dinners. I suppose I got his useless Rudy back. This is an incredibly long anyway. interference segment. And Holy cow. I'm going on a walking holiday this Christmas. Hey, somebody in IT, man. Good. Did you make the decision to holiday within the country this winter because of the blockade, Prime Minister? Well, this is, see, it's are we never done? like traveling at the best of times. <laughs> no. Uh, these are certainly not the best of times. Well, that we can all agree. Uh, there's a lot of red tape involved in leaving yeah, the man. territory at the moment, as I'm sure you're they all aware. Order. They're all yeah. Yeah. Oh, there's a bastard yeah. now. Oh, all in it together. Well, all in it together. Oh, yeah. Also, it doesn't seem very advanced to be Holy going cow. abroad when the rest of the country is grounded. And yet, Julia Salisbury announced today that she'll be visiting Svenland during like the, the state. winter break. Is that really an example of team spirit? Is that really an example of team what? Spirit? Did you know about this, Gail? No one tells me anything, Gail? Peter. You should know that. Why don't you know? Well, leaving that for a moment, it says on this card Dang. that a body like yours must take some planning talking. to achieve. I jumped the gun. What's your morning routine? Well... I have a frigid morning routine. Rigid? It's rigid for fuck's sake! Who is that? Oh, yeah. Uh, a, a rigid and demanding plan that my doctor and personal trainer... <laughs> Who's your personal trainer? Ah, some prick or... Yeah. Is that on your card? I yes. Prime Minister, speaking of planning, oh. with the blockade in its 20th week and the people of this country reeling from its effects, what plans do you have to get us out of this mess? Well, that's a very blunt question. That's over the only one quick. for which you, the democratically elected prime minister, must have an answer. Don't you get smart with me, Pat. I was a Pat. fucking national treasure before you were a twinkle in the milkman's scrotum. You want to talk about plans? Let me tell you about plans. That's all we do. Fucking plans and revised plans. And then meetings to discuss okay. the implementation of plans. And plans and yet more planning for fucking plans and yet more fucking plans. Well, that's good. That's good to know, Pat. You know, Great. I used to really like you, Pat. You were a breath of fresh air. That was a lot right there. Another watch of you. Holy you cow. You get more like him every day. That took like every brain cell. Well, most. I will take that. Most of them. There's still some some left. Prime Minister, later on this evening, your co-leader Julia Salisbury is going to give a national address Hopefully. from team headquarters. Can you give us a hint of what she's going to say? Um, yes. Y y yeah. Uh, 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 I imagine that there sorry, will be sorry, you the imagine? usual. Uh, sorry, sorry, you imagine? No, what, what, I, mean, what you, I mean is. You do know about this broadcast, don't you, Prime Minister? Oh, yeah, sure uh huh. Mean. Um, oh, let me find my um, no reading Maybe material. Each other. We don't memorize each other's bloody diaries either. No. As me old mom used to say. No. 
If you wanted to get a job done quick, don't get bogged down in the pubes. What else you got? Sorry? Only cards. What else? A little piece of my life. Do you want to rustle through? Get out. Refill my ass. Get out. Refill my ass. Ah, come on. Come on. Okay. What music do you listen to when you work out? What music do you listen to when you work out? Well, Gail tells yeah. me that I work out to the little C, but I have absolutely no fucking idea who they, that is. They told me to say that. Do you think the C stands for... It stands for collaborative, Prime Minister. It stands yeah, for collaborative, that, that does make more sense. Actually. Yeah, my wife says I listen to this person. Uh, how's rationing affecting you? I don't really know who, who they are. But we get by, you just have to learn to I don't get know them like the that. Basics. Take I don't know them. In each other. Take I've got Mrs. C. And many of fine Mrs. Singles. C, Little C, Malt C. We got it all. Except for a decent night's sleep. Except that. Cool. Prime Minister, thank you for joining us. When we come back, it's time Ooh. for the culture Commercial. shot with Little C Eight. and a world premiere performance of World her Broadcast. New song. I genuinely must be played. We'll be back after this. And go. One minute back, everybody. Oh, man. All right, all right. Not too bad, not too bad. I don't think you knew about her statement. I don't think anyone's supposed to know. When you mentioned it, Bozeman's face turned a color that I think you call embolism. Ooh, wee. Bozeman? Nah, you're like the daughter. I think the little C segment is going to be a musical segment. I figured it out, right? Who's Lil C? They were talking about, uh, like, the beat. Who's Lil C? And, like, the, the, the audio thing has a beat. What? I'm civilized. Which is books. not the this beat in your ear. So, um... We'll be all right. We got it from now on. We got it. We got it. Hopefully. I mean, yeah. you now have spotted the updated mixing desk. You'll need the new buttons during the next sections. First, we'll need applause when the guest enters and before her song. Don't worry, I'll walk you through it when we get there. Hopefully. Before they appear and during their song. And who I'm supposed to be booing, though, dog? Like, quit playing, man. Like, Tell me about everything. This war. Because as a team, oh, cannot fight my bad. Thrive, even in this most challenging of times. Let's listen to the propaganda. Soon now, when this turbulent I've time is behind us, before. we will glide into a new future. Any good? As a team. Get out of here. Advance. The kids go mad for her, absolutely mad. Five, ten seconds. Hang on, Colin, and you've got kids. Yeah, I've got about six or seven, I think. About what? six or seven? Five. Like rabbits? Four, three. Let's go. Thanks for coming back. Later, right. we have an Thanks exciting new feature you clap that people in. you're going to love, so stay tuned for that. But first, I'm really excited for our next guest. She rose to prominence as the delightful Susie May in All My Daughter's Children's Men before taking the music industry by storm this year with her debut album smashing the chart records at oh, okay. the age of just 20. Let's How long give it up now? and welcome Lil C. <laughs> I just say, you look incredible. Oh, thanks, babe. I'm doing this new regime and it really does work. Ooh. What's the regime? I'm a man regime. Suits me. It basically involves bathing in like cabbage. All right, here we go. And then having this is a little quicker. Of you while you sleep. Wow, is, is that helping? Be here. Oh, well, look at me, Meg. The leaves, my only nourishment. <laughs> yep, they certainly are. Now, you'll have to forgive me, but I'm somewhat of a super fan. So I'm sorry if I get a bit starstruck. <laughs> oh, bless you. I've never actually heard of you before. So if you do get a little tight, I can always carry the interview. Oh, that's good to know. So your first Taking album, F My Face Together, it hit shelves this summer and it just exploded. I mean, what was that like for you? Bonkers, just yeah. so weird. I was in all the okay. papers and the magazines. Overnight, I went from that like annoying little girl from that show to that like sexy little girl from that show. Wow, that must have been bizarre. Not really. It was just like any other morning, you know, get up at five, go on a four mile run, have three meetings on my cabbage bath. But then Good only talk. then was my dad actually talking Good talk. to me. Oh, of course. I mean, the famed country singer, Billy Bob Jean Short. I didn't know you'd been estranged. There's nothing that's strange about it, Megan. OK, yes, he may believe that aliens told him to hate women, but there really isn't anything to prove that he's wrong. Uh huh. You right. Uh huh. No doubt. No doubt. No doubt. So, newfound explosion into your popularity. I mean, did that change your life? Um, well, 
had to start wearing like nice Come on. underwear, you know. We're playing games. But as the manager, T said, minus six minutes. Best to make the most of it before I'm done. Throw it at me. <laughs> Is that right? <laughs> So what, what's the album about? So I thought it was about like how pretty and great I am, but actually it's about monetizing youth, I think, or about like promoting mm. an unrealistic standard of beauty or something. Awesome. Manager again. <laughs> yeah, he says insecurity is an opportunity. Oh, <laughs> do you think he'd be happy with you telling us all this? <laughs> telling you all what? It really doesn't matter what I say here. I'll do my dancing and then this part will it all be forgotten about. Oh. Well, yeah, I mean, oh, okay. we're going to see some of those famous uh -huh. dance moves very shortly. Yeah, you're, 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 you're right. You single, aren't you? Yeah, it's from my album, Put It Brilliant. In My A Together, and it's out tomorrow. So soon, after the last one. Oh, yeah, I've actually released two albums since lunchtime and a clothing line during this interview. Cry, cry, cry. <laughs> so this is called Cry For Help, and it's going to be oh. in all the best high street and retailer shops. And it's Brad. out. Now, so girlies, now. you know what to do. Scream and cry until somebody gets it for you. Ooh. They distracted me. There she goes. They distracted me. <laughs> All these projects, they're keeping you very busy, aren't they? It must be tough. Yeah, it can get tough and I hate it sometimes and I hate myself. I just want to like cry into a bath of root veg. But then I think thousands of girls would do anything to be me. So I must be quite lucky. Well, you, you know you don't have to do this though, don't you? Yeah, I do think that sometimes. Most nights between like my fourth vodka and the eighth time a stranger slaps me around the arse. I think things could have been different, you know, like better. But I don't know. I love doing autographs and having oui. somebody dress me and tell me what to wear. Oui. <laughs> did you always want to do music? Uh, well, ever since I was a little girl, I did. I'd sit in front of the radio, and as soon as my favourite girl yeah, would one come more on, segment after this, we should be able to get the bonus points. Go back upstairs and start practicing. Oh no, it's not going too good. So, sorry, is, you, is your dad your manager? <laughs> yeah, which can be tough. And sometimes when it gets really hard, he'll say, "Make Cragler proud, and you might just survive childbirth." <laughs> well, you know what? Despite anything, you'll make me proud. Oh, if only your opinion was as valuable as his. <laughs> and on that problematic note, uh, you're going to be singing your song for us soon, aren't you? Uh, tell me about it. <laughs> so it's called These Holy Babies Going to Bring You Home. And I actually got sent the lyrics in the car on the way up here. You know what? It's actually all right. And don't worry. All my work is team approved. All right, then. Well, you can go and get ready for that. <laughs> we'll see you in a little bit. Please leave. It was a very specific type of pleasure <laughs> to chat to her, and I just can't wait to hear this. Okay, three Whoa. or four. Here is Lil C with an exclusive first performance. Okay, yay, of everybody love Lil C. Baby's gonna bring you home. Take it away. Go clap. It's the Force's favorite. The Queen of Team. Here to break in your blockade. Hey. Lil C. Hey. No, I take it back. I didn't. I didn't lie. I didn't lie. Oh, I lied. That's empty. I want that meat you're packing. Only you can fill that crack in me. I'm under siege, so come and free me. Ain't no disruption here. Boy, I play games. They want to get me on beat. Do this one. Give me the points. I had to switch the camera. Oh, what's this beat? I got one more segment after this. Hopefully, we can get there. Don't die alone. His pain is gonna bring you home. I ain't no liquor, but I come and skirmish 
I gotta get all the points I can. Oh, he's nice guy. you from the world outside oh we i'm, I'm sorry y'all like holy cow that beat well, didn't that. make no sense to me that thing was after the break, we'll you might as well mute the, 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 the damn thing and use your eyes three seconds of commercial we'll be back crazy right neil and we're Woo. out So you're your manager. Like, oh, oh right. Um, and Michael, oh, wait, Michael, what about the pop jean shorts? Oh my dad. My bad. And um, Michael, I want to see the revenue share for the clothing line and get me a GNT before my meeting with the Lube guys. <laughs> if they say for your pleasure, I'm gonna start needing it. <laughs> Man. This next section will need you to use all four of the sound effects to help things along. Try and pick the most appropriate one in each given moment. The actors can't hear what you're doing, so they'll be trusting you to make the right choices. Do I look like they don't know what I'm doing? Counts things. No, no, no. Ooh, we. Not anymore. I. Right. I'm better than that now. I'll tell you what. Yeah. Just keep settling until it feels like twelve. Got it? Absolutely. Right away. Ten seconds. Five. Four. <clears throat> three. Thanks for joining us for all right. We've been teasing you about our new feature Did all my thing night, inject? and now the wait is finally over. I can reveal that every okay, night on the show, two and three, we'll ten second rule, three seconds of reaction shots, and everything from before. New segment called the Notice Board. It stars some top talent, and we're very excited about it. But before we see it, let's introductions have a chat with the writer, director, and phenomenon. May I say, clap for him. Algebra guys. Hey. hey. I go by Jeff Dupoon now. <laughs> How'd you like that? Oh, yeah, very fancy. I suppose yeah. you need a new name now that you're a successful artist. Well, exactly. I'm earning enough to pay taxes now. <laughs> oh. <laughs> it's shit. <laughs> and how does Angela feel about all this? Ooh. Angela Algebra. Your, uh, your wife. Your, uh, your wife. Uh. Who? <laughs> oh, God, no. Who? <laughs> no. No, Ooh. she's long gone. Oh, no, nice. she was holding me back. I'm with Norm now. We were married last month. <laughs> Norm de Plume. Yeah. <laughs> and, um, Unamused. why did you write this? Hmm? What was your inspiration? Oh, well, I, I received a telephone call offering me 25 grand to write a pro team sitcom. And I heard my mm -hmm. father's voice. And I heard my it said, father's voice. Jeff. It said, you listen here, boy. You make him sunshine. You make him you ring every oh. penny you can get out of this. Ten seconds. So I wheeled him down to the transition centre, got out my typewriter, and started clacking. <laughs> Utter shite. <laughs> and without further ado, let's give it up for the notice board. I had no time to react there. You got to be kidding me. Miss 
Craven. Morning. Oh, Miss Craven. Morning, Ray. Everything all right, Mrs. Craven? Everything you look right. as worried as the vicar in closing right. time. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Ray, it's those oh, young Ray. louts. They've it's vandalized young my young shop again. No! Yes! Oh. of obscene language and food pictures and I know it's those damn you I didn't click shit I don't know my bad it could be the vicar at closing time that's right right I'm just worried they won't ever become productive members of the community what if they never see the error of their ways and end up a social outcast such as shop lift or bong rats. Don't worry, Mrs. Craven. This is a Was very that okay? supportive community. And I'm sure that in time, sure they will fit into in this society like this key into this lock. Should we have laughed? <laughs> See? Works like a charm. What a lovely way to put it, Ray. And just like that, we can unlock their future. Yes, yes. Yay. Wow. Look at all the letters in my collection today. Oh, I think that one's addressed to me. What? This, this one? Oh, so you're right. Oh. <laughs> Here it is. <laughs> it's a letter from my granddaughter, Bre Brenda. She says she got an A on her maths exam. Yay. One of her friends has been helping her. She was always a team player with our Brenda. What's up, losers? What's up, losers? That was an intro? Oh. Dude came in too fast, no. bro. It Man, does. I'm butchering this. My bad. He's the coolest guy. In the village. That's right. Clap. I just got here on my motorbike. Oh, clear off, Brad. We don't want any of your ilk Ooh. around here. What? Brad dudes? No, ruffians. Have you come to tag the notice board with your gang signs? No way. I've actually come to pin my resume on that notice my board. My resume. I'm looking to do some tutoring after school. What? Did you say... Should we have clapped? Tutoring? That's right. Maths is very That's important. Right. Clap. Would you mind, Ray? Would you mind, Ray? Not at all. <laughs> so you, a young person, have been spending your time helping others and not Bruh. just urinating on churches or huffing glue? Hey, I haven't huffed glue for months. Well, blow me down! <laughs> you, you know what? We misjudged you based on how young and cool you are and not on your actions. Oh, no joy. So it wasn't you who vandalized my shop last night or called me a rancid old crone from the back of a chopper? No way. It can't have been me. I was too busy helping my friend Brenda with her maths homework. Could you speak up there? Should I clap? I thought for a minute there that you said Brenda. I did, you daft old sow. Did you hear that, Ray? Oh, yes, what a wonderful yes, surprise. Wonderful I now respect surprise. you as a man. Put her there, Ray. I hit every button. <laughs> oh, what the heck? What the Give heck? Give us a hug. Hello? I was struggling with that. That was a lot. Holy cow. No!
Uh, hello? Sorry to interrupt the first groundbreaking episode of the notice board, but uh, hello? we're receiving some breaking news. Um, I'm being told um, we are picking up reports from we across good? the continent of what appear to be what appear to be nuclear explosions in four major foreign cities. Whoa. Initial estimates put the death toll into. Initial estimates put the death toll into. Uh, they put them into millions. I'm, I'm being told we're experiencing um, some power shortages as a result. So apologies, apologies for the interruption. And apparently we can go live now to team headquarters for an emergency broadcast from okay. Prime Minister Julia Salisbury um, any moment. Yes. Yes. Let's go to that now. Yes. Yes. Let's go to that now. Good evening, citizens and leaders of the world. Oof. Minutes ago, operatives working for advanced Man, I'm like detonated nuclear amped up from that last segment. Holy cow. In four major cities. We finally the pulled continent. it out. Yay. We have similar devices but dang. in 58 other urban centers. Right, and we will go. not hesitate Ooh. to detonate them. If our conditions are not met in full. Y'all the terrorists. Alan James ain't bomb nobody. Our territory will no longer tolerate be burnt a few buildings down. And genocidal blockade. No damn nuclear explosion. Immediately. We will accept nothing less than your unconditional surrender. Oh. Your territories will be taken under our control. We will install replacement governments to ensure that your citizens become part of the new future. Is this why my guy was nervous? Your did he know or did he not know? And now our borders your people are our people oh y'all saw that will finally be y'all saw how seamless that and was clothed, and educated and healed you'll put me back down there but for your privileged but few the moment that they feared is now upon them allow me to be crystal clear I kind of want to play that now. A single shot. But I think I would lose all my points and die in the black space. Or harm a single one of our citizens. We will not hesitate to detonate further devices. You will not find them. Y'all are awful. Then no doubt you are already searching for them. Our technology is decades ahead of yours. Decades. We will expect your complete acceptance of our terms by midnight tonight. Or? Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. How do you follow that I up? I don't really talk about my personal life in my job. I don't really talk about my personal it's not relevant or important. Um, or important. Um, so many of you may be surprised to learn that I have so a brother. His name is David. Oh, no. And right now I, and right now I, I can't get a stupid face out of my head. He's a researcher and he's currently traveling the continent for work. And, he's currently traveling and I don't, the continent for work. and I don't, I don't know where he is right now. Know where he is right now. And I should imagine that there are many of you sitting at home tonight digesting this, this news. And you also have loved ones on the continent in Urkishdan or Javier, or San Palmarino, or, or Konislava, which is where David was when I last spoke to him three days ago. So when I tell you I know how you are feeling tonight, believe me, I do. But I also know that there's, there's a flow to events. I see it every day here. I know that although tonight it feels like we may be in a time of fear and darkness, we may actually be at the break of a new dawn. We don't know that yet. We can't know that yet. But together we will find out. And I will be here every night feeling what you are feeling. And with your help, maybe we can all get to that brave new world. Holy cow. My name's Megan Wolf. Commercial. Let's make tomorrow better. Let's do that. And we're out. G. Willikers, Batman. Holy cow, oh, no, no. man. The telephone networks are overloaded. No, we good. Find him. Do we know exactly exactly which cities were hit or Megan? Man. Megan. We will find him.
man, I, I ooh wee, I feel it. Like, dang, man, I gotta shake this one out. Um, thank you so much for watching. Uh, like and subscribe and all that stuff. Uh, holy cow, uh, I'm gonna go take a break, a breather, and uh, come back for more later. See ya. Damn.